Don't just live for tomorrow Or just live for yesterday Just be glad for all you have that's in today And though you've come through many obstacles Hey everyone, Connie here, and welcome to my blind reaction to The Cuphead Show, episode 2. So, the first episode was pretty fun. It, it kept alive the spirit of the old, classic cartoons. Um, not as Fleischer rubber hose as I was expecting, but still very fun, very entertaining, high energy, quick paced, and very, very snappy with its humor. Um, I still cannot snap my fingers. <laughs> um, but I enjoyed it. Uh, it wasn't perfect. There were some things that I wasn't like super great with. Like Cuphead and Mugman's voices are kind of annoying. But And, and the opening I don't like. I, I've watched the opening multiple times since I recorded the first episode reaction. And I, I don't like it. I don't know. It just seems off and i don't i don't know how to explain why but it just seems like it's off and something about it just feels weird like it's not like i don't know i don't know how to describe it but i i'm not a fan of it so we'll be skipping that for future reactions but yeah i'm just definitely interested to see where this goes because as of now cuphead owes the devil his soul and that's pretty much where the story's at. There's no other ongoing plot threads at the moment. No other big things. We had them at the at the carnival or carnival. <laughs> and we're just kind of going from there. Um, like I said in the first uh, reaction though. Apparently th this has gotten some mixed reviews. Some people really like it. Some people have a lot of issues with it. For me it's... It's good. I, I, I think the good outweighs the bad, but there is some negative stuff I do see to it. But we'll see how it goes. So let's just get this started and hope for the best. When the screen fades to black, pause this redirect and go to the description below. Follow the link to the reaction, and after you watch it, come back here to the redirect and resume play. Because after it fades to black and it fades back in, everything for that point forward will be my afterthoughts and will contain spoilers to the episode. So, with that being said, thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you at the reaction. And we are back, and we'll begin with spoilers in 3, 2, 1, now. So, I guess you, even with 12 short episodes, this season, or this series, or whatever you want to call it, is going for a very episodic nature, because there was no point to this episode. It didn't further the plot or really much of anything. It was really pointless overall. Like, with the first episode clearly set things up with the entire thing about Cuphead owing the devil his soul. And watching through this episode, I, I, where I'm thinking this is going is that um, I'm thinking the baby was going to be like either the devil in disguise or that the devil, or was sent by the devil to eventually take Cuphead's soul after messing with them quite a bit. That's where I thought this was going. But no, this had nothing to do with anything. Instead, it was just some random baby for no reason is dropped off at Cuphead, Mugman, and Elder Kell's door. And it's just, you know, typical cartoon baby shenanigans with the baby being smarter than it realistically could be and being actively antagonistic towards the main characters who are trying to act like parental figures to it. That's all this episode is. And in the end, they get rid of the baby by giving it to someone else, presumably for everything to start all over again. It's, like, th this is clearly a thing that had been done in older cartoons and everything. A lot of cartoons have done this throughout the years, throughout the decades. And it it's just, it's been a common thing, but 
it's one of those tropes that just in my opinion at least isn't good it's it's one of those ongoing gags that you see in various cartoons that i've never thought was actually good and i don't understand why they kept doing this like you'd see this kind of thing in all kinds of cartoons again all over the decades and it's like why it's it's almost never enjoyable it's annoying it's just dumb and maybe that's just me maybe it's just me maybe it's because i don't like the entire thing about babies being overly intelligent i think it's just kind of ridiculous and i don't know i just don't like it and maybe that's part of why i didn't like this episode but it's like it just it felt like a step backwards not only was it ignoring the main plot that was set up in episode one that is kind of a big deal but it's just again it's not entertaining um i didn't really enjoy this one at all and the entire thing about like cuphead being like bad at being a parent and mug man being uh motherly and all it's like that's also very kind of stereotypical with a lot of these the main main character or the one who's like obviously more of the focus is going to be the one who has the trouble and then you have the more sidekick character who's uh more of the silly unserious uh like again sidekick character so of course they're going to be displayed as the motherly one it'd be like making a mario series and having that be with like how Ma the dynamic goes with mario and luigi it's just it i don't like that making the second player the the second player character automatically be like that kind of stereotype just i've never enjoyed that kind of thing and it's just it's it's annoying it's honestly annoying and it's like you could see where everything was going to go you you understood that the rules that elder kettle set in place were both going to be broken the radio was going to get destroyed you understood pretty much everything on how this was going to go and it's just I don't, it's just not entertaining to me it, it's a far step away from the first episode which started off real the series really well this one just kind of took it way too many steps back for me i didn't like it uh but if you did that's perfectly fine then tell me what you thought down in the comments below uh for now thank you so much for tuning in i'm connie and i'm signing off see y'all next time